All right, here we go, King Yella. King Yella. King Yella. King Yella. King Yella. King Yella. What's going on? Y'all know what's going on, man. It's your boy, man. Mr. Talkative. That's what y'all gonna do with Mr. Run His Mouth. Mr. Motor Mouth. My pops used to come. Matter of fact, that's what y'all call me for now. Motor Mouth, man. Motor Mouth Yellow, man. Yeah, it is what it is, man. This mouth gonna make me a lot of money running this motherfucker. Look at it from the side. Ugly. Hey, but look. Brick Baby, man. Brick Baby, Brick Baby, Brick Baby, Brick Baby, Brick Baby. Brick Baby, baby, baby. They say Brick Baby admits that if Dirk would have asked him to back though, drop the low on Quando Rondo, even though he from 6-0, he would have did it. Why? Because hm. Dirk is friend. It's his boy. That's his homie. I thought you was my homie, Brick. So if Dirk would have asked you to backdoor me, you would have did it too. Mm -hmm. I don't even know if I could trust you no more, Brick. Pissed off right now. You would have gave me up. You would have gave me up, Brick. Hear what Brick had to say. Brick Baby says he would have dropped Quando Rondo's low if Dirk would have asked him. Why is that? Then it's people like, you lined up somebody from your hood. Like, listen, I didn't do it. But at the <laughs> end of the day, what's wrong with giving my friend the address? Oh, look, this is my boy. He lost his boy. Who did it could be real. I'm nine times out of ten, if had he had asked me, I probably would have been. You know, if he even asked anybody, if this is even true. Like I said, if he make the car right now, I dig his up here. That was a crazy one. Brick Baby says he would have dropped Quando. How y'all feel about that? They already think Brick Baby dropped the low. I don't think Brick Baby dropped the low because he wouldn't be talking like that. He wouldn't have said if they asked, I would have did it. When you drop the low and you see this going on, you see murder, murder for hire. These are cases that you could never come home on. These are cases you're going to be gone for the rest of your life, PP. I don't even think he would be even speaking. Because I know he ain't no dummy like the rest of these guys. The rest of these guys is dummies. A lot of them are dummies. Big, big old, big old dummies that run their mouth and tell on themselves and do interviews and be sarcastic. And, <laughs> and these people go running back and look at it like, what you mean about that? <laughs> what are you talking about? They going to judge you off. Your lifestyle anyway. It ain't finna really. It ain't if you guilty or not guilty. You guilty already. And the eye of the law, you are. They, they don't matter. They're going to say dirt guilty. I'm guilty. Brick baby guilty. Whoever is guilty. Once you went been to the prisons and been thugging and living like that, man, no matter what. What you do, you come try to change the world and be Farrakhan, Malcolm X, Martin Luther King. Do whatever you want to do. Still going to book you. But how y'all feeling? Y'all feel like Brick said if Dirk would have asked him, if he would have asked him, he would have gave up the low ski. Bro ski. So he letting y'all know that if he would have told him, if he would have asked him, if it is true, like if it did happen, he would have did it. So therefore already... He ain't got no love for no Quando Rondo or, or whoever. Just because he's from 6 up. Y'all don't know how this shit go no more. Nobody care what gang you from. You could be from my gang. You ain't my homie. You just uh, somebody from the same gang as me. That don't mean nothing. Not that, man. What do that mean? It means zero. Nada. It means uh-uh. means who are you? I don't care because you G. Folks don't care because you 6 up. You know how many niggas from 6 probably ain't did nothing for him? The same way how many niggas from GD ain't did nothing for me? Are you supposed to expect a nigga to be like, oh, because he one of the guys? <laughs> no, yeah, you one of the guys, but you're not my friend. I don't know you. I don't, you know, you ain't never did nothing. We ain't never did nothing for each other. So I feel how it go. Because the average person, gang, if somebody, if it's your homie or whatever going on in the streets or however y'all living, thugging, whatever, Whatever y'all got going on, 
and some of your homie, boy, you got food low, or da 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 da. Nine times out of ten, you gonna drop it. You ain't gonna say about it. no, bro. Hey, I ain't giving up no address, or I ain't involving myself in that. You're gonna give it up. You're gonna give it up. You're gonna get, hand it over. <laughs> that's exactly what's gonna happen. But do y'all think that's wrong, or do y'all think that's right? What do y'all think? Do y'all think he's a real friend, or do you think he's a fake friend? Because then, hmm, let's say, if Fool did know that he had the low or had something to do with the low or knew about the low, and he didn't call and drop it, and knowing whatever's going on and how people feel, like he said, Fool lost his homie, his friend, whatever, his brother, his twin. You think they still be homies? You think he still be cool with him? I don't think so. I think he'd be like, mm, you you back though. Or you you ain't my friend or you ain't my homie like you say you is. You know what I'm saying? And that's what that that that's the truth. That'll be what's going on. Cause in reality, if it's up with somebody for me and one of my boys from that section, and you know something about something and you you ain't in cahoots with me to even chop it up with me. Yeah, I'm going to feel some type of way. Definitely going to feel some type of way. I'm looking, that's, that's strange to me. But you you my homie, you know what I'm saying? But I don't know. I've been around Brick Baby. I've been in, uh, you know, jumping with Brick Baby. I've been to the uh, 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 Wild and Out with Brick Baby. You know what I'm saying? I didn't get no backdoor vibes because, I don't know, we first had something, you know, when I first went to Cali, I ain't know that he messed with Dirk and them. You know, he told me to pop out to the thing. That was kind of like, mm, I don't know, fool, fuck with fool and them, so can I trust him? He was going to backdoor me, Brick. I don't know. But Brick stand tall, like firm, like even on the the, the podcast. Like Brick don't downplay me or get down on me. Like, he don't agree with a lot of shit that people say. And that's why I salute him. I mess with him. Like, me, I'm not going to agree with y'all to say, uh, Brick did this or he did it up. Because, you know, that's our relationship already or how we, you know, came together already. Like, we had the whole thing. Like, he could have yelling them up in here right now. Jay, man, we'll do Like, because it was still kind of cracking or whatever people say or feel. And, and Dirk is homie. But he right there with me. And I'm his homie, too. So, <laughs> it's like, I didn't get no backdoor vibes. Like, I kind of feel like fool. Of, you know, and I'm just talking. I'm, break, you gonna backdoor me? I'm just playing. Like, I don't, you know, I didn't get that feel from him. It was all genuine love. Like, you know, the energy. Like, we just rocking, having a ball. Still chopping up on the phone. Everything. So, I don't, you know, maybe everybody different. But, you know, y'all let me know how y'all feel in the comment section. It's your boy, King Yeller. Big Racks, a.k.a. Motor Mouth.